It's a chilly morning. Here in college, you have just arrived. Good morning, my beautiful people. It's your boy, Clinton. And today, we're actually coming live and clear from uh, Kissy Guys. And uh, being early in the morning, this is how the day looks like, guys. This is how the day looks like. This is early morning here in Kisi, Kenya. You can see on the other side we have a river flowing. And uh, there's a lot of water. If you are very, very careful, there's a lot of water, guys. I don't know if you can see that. Maybe let me show you from this other side. So you can see very, very well. Oh, check out that. And uh, the reason for this, guys, it's because uh, there's a lot of rain here in Kisi. It's raining a lot. And uh, the local time now in Kenya is around uh, uh, 7.30 a.m. in the morning. And uh, it was raining at around uh, 4 a.m. in the morning. You can imagine that. And that is why you can see the ground is uh, very, very wet. I don't know, guys, if it's uh, only in Kisi. Let me know in the comment section down below. If you are from around Kenya or around East Africa, let me know if it's raining in your countries or in your regions. And I know this is the month of April. People are farming, to be specific, here in Kenya. And uh, this is when they need a lot of rain. And uh, by saying rain, I mean water in the soil or uh, most soil so that uh, they can be able to grow. You know, when we have uh, dry soil, there's nothing that can grow. So the soil at this time is uh, moist. and. Uh, this is the best time to plant, guys. And uh, uh, at this time, I'm uh, heading to the college. I completed my examination in the other week around uh, Friday. And now we are working on uh, registration for our uh, end of, I can simply say, end of uh, college uh, examination. We are actually doing registration for that examination or for that paper, which will mark... Uh, the end of our studies here in Kisia, around the month of uh, July there. So at this time, people are uh, registering for the examination so that uh, at the end of the year, they can uh, be able to see the examination. And uh, in some few years to come, they're going to graduate also and uh, find some job out there to do, guys. And uh, because I was heading to the college and uh, most of the time, uh, my time is, uh, I don't have uh, lots of time, especially during the weekdays, to film. And I decided uh, this morning, I want to show you my way to the college and the situation over here, guys. So let's go. And go ahead. Yeah. So let's go, guys. We are going to the college now. And uh, if you have, if you have just uh, subscribed to our YouTube channel, thank you so much for stopping by. Uh, my name is Clinton. I'm uh, born and raised in uh, Kenya, in Africa. And uh, to be specific, I'm coming from Narrow County. Narrow County is one of the counties that uh, is uh, located in Kenya. And uh, I'm based here in Kisi because I'm a student. Or uh, I am a trainee. Yeah, they usually say trainee. And uh, this is where I usually carry out my, my studies from uh, one of the best colleges that we have in uh, Kisi. And uh, that is where we are going to now. So keep it locked, watch the video till the end, and uh, get the full experience. So let's go. It's a calm morning. You can see most of the shops have actually opened. You can see on the other side. And on this other side of the road, they are kind of calm, guys. But maybe in the evening, this, way, this, this is the point that uh, people usually open. Uh, boutiques and also saloons and some shops. Yeah. And even some portion with like that iron sheet uh, structure over here. We have a portion mill over there. And let's go. Let's go, guys. So, guys, uh, in case you are coming across uh, this YouTube channel for the very first time, kindly consider to subscribe. 
you can give the video a like you can share and also uh, tell a friend to tell a friend that we are on the road to 5,000 subscribers and uh, very soon we shall be there guys and we also watch chasing our watch hours I know very very soon I have hope that uh, very soon we shall uh, monetize our channel also but uh, apart from that guys give the video a like and uh, that is how you are going to make us achieve our dreams uh, very very fast if hundred of you are going to give this video a like I'll be very very happy and uh, let's do that let's do that guys can see it's wet everywhere guys I don't know if you can see this but it's not muddy you can tell it's not like it's muddy you can just walk very very comfortable let's go let's go down so I'm heading to Mwembe now from here I'm going to the next uh, uh, the next uh, like a neighborhood or uh, estate from here is called Mwembe and that is where I'm heading to now that is where I am heading to and uh, any time from now it can even start raining you can see it's even dark somehow uh, around uh, 85% of our skies are covered by clouds. 85% you can imagine. Only the 15% is what you are seeing on the other side. The only blue skies I see around, but all this other side is dark, totally dark. Yeah. You can see this. Man, you can imagine when it rains and water is full all over here. Ah. So this SDJ is called Mwembe and uh, on the other side is uh, I think a place called Sebwe. Sebwe is on the other side. If you saw our last video, that was the side that I passed through in our last video. Over there. of beautiful beautiful trees on the other side yeah, it's quite a beautiful neighborhood I can say And uh, this is the time that people are rushing to jobs because being 7 a.m. in the morning, that is the best time to catch a means of transport if you are going far for job or walk to your place of work and even walk to school. Because the other day it was an, an holiday and uh, now people are out. They have to go for job. They have to go work. Uh, this, uh, I think this is the month. Uh, this is the month of April, and uh, during the month of April, many, many schools usually close for the April holiday. And, uh, in uh, universities, uh, like this university, for example, students go for long holidays. But in our college, we usually go home for like uh, one month and we are back. 
and then uh, we report for the second uh, or the third semester uh, I can simply say second semester in this case from May to June and then July you sit for your examinations depending on the course that you are you are you are pursuing or the field that you are pursuing and uh, uh, also high school and uh, primary uh, kids or students they also go for they also go for the April holiday and uh, that is in Kenya guys I don't know in your countries how we usually do that maybe in the comment box down below you can let us know how we usually do that in uh, in your specific countries yeah so this is uh to Savoy this is to Kisi University uh, but for me I want a branch because I have several rules that I usually use when uh, heading to uh, my college. So let's go there. So this way you go to the university, that route over there. But here yeah, I want to go to our institution, guys, of Kisi National Polytechnic. And here yeah, we have a beautiful entry to the coffee research. I know you guys are familiar with this place if you have been watching my videos very, very closely. I know you are familiar with this place. Wow. And the sun is just trying to show up, guys, on the other side. And it's super nice, super beautiful. This is uh, nature, guys. This is connecting with nature. Mother Nature is so beautiful. This river, if you follow this river, you find yourself in Kisi University. It flows from those sides, but I'm very sure it flows from uh, the foot of uh, Kyonganyo Hills on your way to Keroka from Kisi. And guys, I'm usually taken by these trees over here. I don't know how many times I've shown this tree, but they are very, very beautiful and very, very huge. Check out that. Let's see even another one over here. They look very, very old. And I'm very, very sure some of them are more than 50 years old or even 100 years old. Let's go up. So this is the coffee research uh, center and you can tell even there are a lot of uh, coffee coffee growing around here a lot of coffee and if you if you have been keen uh, watching my videos uh, our last video or our second last video that I did hiking Nyanguru Hills. I also came across a lot of uh, coffee, coffee farms, a lot of uh, tea farms uh, as compared to coffee farms. But here, there are a lot of coffee as compared to tea farms. I've not seen uh, tea farms very, very, very close to Kisi town, but I've seen a lot of uh, coffee growing. Even in our institution, uh, very, very close to our institution, we have some farms where people have grown coffee. And uh, this to tell you that climate here is uh, very, very favorable for uh, growing such kind of uh, crops. Maybe here you cannot grow like uh, the cotton, you cannot grow the sisal, yeah, but you can grow tea, coffee, bananas, which is the main like the staple food of the Abagosi people. But uh, generally, Kenya, our main staple food is uh, corn or uh, maize, as some of you can say. Yeah. So guys, uh, this is the life of a college student here in Kenya. Walking to the college, 
I don't know, it usually takes me around uh, 15 to 18 minutes to be there. And uh, this is the journey, guys. I don't know, maybe in your place, maybe in your specific countries, maybe do you wait for a bus by your uh, gate? Even in, in Kenya, it happens, but for primary kids or for primary students, and even some secondary schools, but I'm, I'm not sure. Maybe for secondary is when they close, they're going to be like uh, traveling by, this, by the use of a uh, school bus to their uh, homes. But here, for college students or university students, you have to walk to, walk to your place of uh, studies. And uh, that is what, what I'm trying to share with you today as we keep going, guys. And that is the situation over here. Check out that. It has been raining a lot. Oh. Dangerous roads. <laughs> Let's go, guys. Oh. Maybe I need my friends to record record these for shots. But uh, it is what it is. So let's go. Ahead of us, we have a lot of uh, water also. Guys, this is how we cross. This is how we cross. It's no joke. You have to be very, very careful. Yeah. You have to be extra careful when you're crossing here. Because the moment you just trip and fall, and you're heading to college here like me, you have to go back to the house and get the new clothes and come back. And by that time, you'll have wasted. You'll have wasted more than uh, more than an hour, even, depending on where you are coming from. Wow. So, guys, uh, let me know what you think about our today's video. I just wanted to share with you uh, my morning journey to the college, or my morning routine as a college student here in Kenya. And uh, maybe the comment box down below, drop it, uh, your comments, or drop your opinions about uh, college life or high school life in your specific countries. How do people travel to colleges or even high school and primary schools? And uh, let us know. I don't know guys, I have several options. And uh, I think today, today let's use uh, today let's use Get B, guys. I want to go and use Get B. What says the college? It is right over there. Yeah. And we have a main entrance on the other side, and we have a Get B on this other side that I'm heading to. So this road is a uh, Kisi Keroka Road or Kisi Nairobi Road. And you see now people are traveling like crazy. I need to close very, very fast because we have a truck coming. They call them Keeper. This truck's over here. Wow. And it's a chilly morning, guys. Uh, when you're coming to Kisi, I'll just advise you to ensure carry all your jackets, all your, even gum boots, guys. It is, uh, it is advisable for you to have such kind of uh, gears. You need to have an umbrella. Carry your umbrella, carry your jacket, uh, your, your rainy jacket, carry your jumper, and even gloves, if possible. Yeah, maybe you're a big fan. You can do that. I want to show you something here. 
it says the Kiss National Polytechnic. 200 meters from here. So if you are from Kenya and uh, you are looking for a place where you can uh, study, uh, there are a lot of programs which are uh, going on in uh, Kiss University. There are a number. There are a lot of courses you can take. Uh, and if you are from Kenya, Kisi National Polytechnic is here to ensure that you get your your certificates, you get uh, to study, guys, in a very very good way and gain a lot of knowledge and experience in the field of study. So that is the perimeter wall for the college. We're almost there. We're not far. On the other side we have like a school, an academy school. But they're closed. At this time they are closed. So these are uh, this route also will uh, will take me to the college and it also take you to uh, Kenya Red Cross Kisi branch. Uh, it, will also, it, will also, it will also take you to ATC and uh, we also have uh, several processing factories on the other side, like the Avo Fresh Coca Cola, though it died, and also we have. Uh, the banana processing plant. I think the ones which are active now is the banana processing plant and the Avo Fresh. And I don't know if you have the one which is uh, for milk processing, but I'm very sure of uh, Avo Fresh and uh, the banana processing plant. Because Coca Cola, it died, but it, the building is still there. If you have been watching uh, me closely, you must be familiar with the environment too. Because Kisi, we have uh, explored deeply. So as I was telling you, very close to our institution, we have uh, coffee also. Oh man, check out that. You see this is a coffee farm on the other side. I don't know if you can see very well or uh, the sun might affect. On the other side that is coffee. And uh, right here is just uh, our institution. Yeah. There's a lot of uh, farming going on in uh, Kisi, guys. And uh, that is your boy there. We are walking, guys. We are almost there. We are almost arriving at Gate B. I remember I've done a lot of videos here in our institution. Our second video, I did it here. I also did some videos with um, my friends from Nyabuhanze. That is uh, Pesaman and uh, Lucas the Traveler. Brothers, big shout out to you from wherever you're watching this video from. And also, we once took uh, Man Victor, a big brother. Big shout out to you also. We also took him to our institution. Um, I think the other year we were together with Brian Vlogs. So, guys, all those that I've said, I've mentioned, they are my fellow content creators. Kindly go check them out from. Man Victor, uh, Brian Vlogs, Lucas the Traveler or Village Farmer this time, and also Pesaman. Subscribe to the YouTube channel and also many other YouTubers who, are, who, who you have seen appearing in my videos. Just go subscribe to the YouTube channels. So I want to take you to the college. I'm just arriving. You can see students are just entering one after the other and I'm supposed to provide my my card yeah but uh, so guys this is what I was supposed to give to show so that I can enter but I don't want to show my details but I know you have seen already and uh, for me I'm just open I don't hide anything yeah It's a chilly morning here in college. You have just arrived. And, uh, I want to do check out one, two, three. A, a stuff here, uh, and also I'm going to run to the town to run to run some errands. There are some stuff 
I'm supposed to pick from somebody somewhere. Wow. I don't know if students here are like shocked or I want to take you to the top uh, floor and give you a glimpse before we end our video guys. I know I've never shown you that. I want to show you campus life, the real campus or university life or college life in this case. Yeah. So guys, uh, let's go up. I want to avoid those crowds and uh, we go up and show you some points from up there, guys. So let's go. Guys, we are finally here. We are finally at the college and uh, this is how the day looks like. Still cloudy. Any agent? Yeah. It's still cloudy and uh, maybe it's going to rain any minute from now. I don't know. So I want to give you a, I want to have a, to have a bird's eye of uh, the institution. I'm not going to show you the entire institution because this is one of the buildings. And I think it's a, a four stories. Wow. So we are here, guys. We are here. And we are coming from down there, on the other side. Wow, I need to be careful with my phone. Guys, you know this feeling when you are on the, the top floors and you fear that maybe your device will drop. But in this case, no, it's not going to drop, guys. Wow. So guys, uh, we're finally there and uh, I just like to wind up our video from here so that I can uh, be able to run some errands here and there uh, concerning maybe the registration of the examination. I'm also supposed to rush to town to pick something. And uh, guys, I just hope to see you in our next video. Coming soon, guys. So keep, in, keep on subscribing, keep on giving the video a like. You can share it with your friend. Tell a friend to tell a friend that you are on the road to 5,000 subscribers and very soon you shall be there. And uh, for me, it's just to say thank you. And I hope to see you in our next video. Coming soon, guys. Ciao.